for a, another video. I had posted a photo on um, the, one of the Chic Spiro groups and also on Instagram of these three items that I have here. And um, some people wanted to take a look inside, especially this was a piece of discussion. Um, and someone wanted to take a look inside just to see what I have set for the new year. And these are just like my personal items. I do have a traveler's notebook that I'm using for Peaky Dory Designs. Um, and I do have a traveler's notebook that I'm using for um, like a project that I'm working on. But these are like my journal and stuff my personal everyday carry wallet, my personal planner, and this I'm using as a pencil pen pouch. So why don't we start here, since this is the thing that people were most, uh, had some questions about, because it looks different than what you can find now. This I've had for over a year, and it is what Jennifer called the simple pouch. Now, when the Simple Pouch first came out, um, she had created it for Allie Brown so her um, buttered rum Mr. Darcy wouldn't get any extra tan sessions um, or unwanted tan sessions. Um, and she made them out of two leathers. She made them out of the brown leather. And then she made them out of this. It is the black leather that's kind of like embossed. So it looks like it is um, like an alligator sort of a print. And you can see it's all the way around. And even on, I'm not sure if it's showing, even on the tag, this little flag here. Um, so let's see what I have in here. And as you can see, I have way too much stuff, but it's the stuff that I use the most. <laughs> um, I have, oh, that's where they all went. I guess that's where these extra pens went. So I have some Muji in the, um, 038. I've got four of them and they're all relatively full. Um, that's these Muji black pens in the 038. It's my favorite pen. Okay. I guess that's the only one. And then I have here for what very little color coating I do. I have some friction highlighters. They are in, you know, the pastel colors, yellow, green. It's more like a creamsicle orange, blue, and just a regular yellow friction. Um, but these are a new addition to my highlighters. And these are the midliner. And one reason why I like these is they have kind of that, I'm not sure if it's showing, that chisel end. And then it also has this right here. Can you see that? I have the tripod a little too tall. Let me pause and pause. Okay, we're back. We're a little bit lower, which I think is better. So. These are the mid-liners, or mild liners, sorry, mild liners, that have the chiseled nib, and then the, um, oh, where we are, then the fine point. And those are new, and I have those in, like, a baby blue, a pink, a yellow, an orange, and a green. You know, very similar to the colors that I have here except the pink isn't, I don't have in here. Um, let's see, I see these. These are a um, Stadler set. The yellow highlighter, the blue ballpoint pen, the um, 0 0.5 millimeter pencil, and then this is the um, black fine liner that really kind of looks like a deep dark gray, not a black but I really like it. Um, this is one of the only white gel pens I have, and it is the um, Uniball Signo Broad. I do have a um, Sakura Jelly Roll, but um, I like this one better. Let's see. 
Ah, here we are. These are um, Faber-Castell or Castile, however you want to say that. And I've got a medium, a brush, and what is the S one for? The small, the small nib. Um, and I have these in case I'm writing over like stickers or, you know, some artwork or, you know, like watercolor that I've laid down. Um, something very similar to those are these right here. And these are the um, Sakura, Sakura, uh, Micron, I'm not sure if that's showing up. And they're the 05, and I have them in this like purplish color, or no, here they are. The purple one the fiance has. I've got them in a black, a brown, or a blue, black, blue, and like a, oops, I'm nowhere near the center, or a sepia, black, blue, and, and like a sepia brownie color. Um, I, I guess I have two of the blacks. These are like one of my favorite pens. They are the um, Pilot High Tech C um, Mica pens, and I have them in the blue, black, and the black. I do have the whole set of colors, but these are the ones I use the most when I'm writing in my planner. Um, I have a an eraser pencil thing that has Bats Maru on it. Um, I like that. I think it's cute. And then I also have a Muji eraser. Let's see. And that's what that means right there. Eraser. Um, I've got a Muji 0 0.5 pencil. I have a Kuratake, if that's showing, it's that glossy, uh, Kuratake brush pen. Ooh, you can see right there. It's actually kind of a hard brush, and um, yeah, I'm not sure if I like it. I love the ink that's in it, but I'm not sure if I like the actual pen itself. Oh, and this was this rolled off to the side. It is a Faber Castile Extra Small. I have that as well. I have two of the uh, Pilot uh, Coletto pens. This is the Coletto Lumio in silver, and it just has four inks. It's got red, green, like a light blue, and a black. The only reason it has a light blue is I like the blue black, but I ran out of it, so I put the light blue in. Um, this one has purple, orange, black, the blue, black, and a, like a real blue. Um, some lead, because all of my pencils are 0 0.5. Um, this is one of those um, Target Dollar Spot heart gel pencils, and it's gold. And this one actually works really well. Sometimes they're kind of crappy, but this one works really well. And then I have this. This is from the tar Target Dollar Spot and it's one of those like highlighters. Let's see if we can see that. That's kind of like a crayon. It's one of the strangest things. I also have one in oop, pink, but I like the blue one the best. So that's the contents of this simple pouch. And you can see this pouch. This is the um, smaller sized one. I got it to hold, um, I mean, look at all that. And it's not busting up the seams or anything. It's pretty darn amazing. Um, but I got it originally to hold like a, a passport, uh, you know, that I had Jennifer make at Chic Sparrow and yeah. But that's what's in here. And what I think I might do is I think I might make these um, a couple of videos. One first showing the pencil pouch and one showing what's in these two. Um, so look forward to a video coming that shows what's in my Sheik Sparrow Narrow and my pocket. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.